To address the unique set of problems with cloud security, Node Zero Cloud Pen Testing gives users a plethora of options when it comes to pen testing cloud environments. Firstly, nearly all attack content in the product today that addresses cloud native weaknesses is accessible through the flagship product, which is grouped into the infrastructure attack surface category. With the flagship pen tests, the internal and external pen tests that you see here, there are plenty of ways to test in the cloud. First, the most obvious is that Node Zero users can deploy a Node Zero host and execute an internal pen test directly from within the cloud environment. However, some of the most interesting attack paths that arise from a more multifaceted test like this, which demonstrates how attackers can chain together findings from seemingly unrelated security domains to do more damage, can be found by casting a wide net across an entire digital infrastructure and a little bit of OSINT knowledge. Leaning into the machine speed combinatorics and its autonomous nature, Node Zero will then attempt to exploit vulnerabilities while deciding how to use any harvested data, credentials, and intelligence to achieve the greatest blast radius available to an attacker, including the ability to pivot in and or out of in-scope cloud environments. Users can also deploy Node Zero from Horizon 3's cloud to take on an external perspective and validate the security controls of their attack surface. This type of test category is an exceptional way to understand from an assumed breach perspective how an attacker can move through an organization's infrastructure with no prior knowledge of the target, verify the effectiveness of the organization's security stack, and demonstrate through proof the pathways for sophisticated attacks, whether a CVE, misconfiguration, or weak controls are used, using context of each pen test instead of industry hype. Now, to address weaknesses that exist, but are hidden layers behind defense in depth or zero trust controls, organizations must also acknowledge the reality of how real world attackers operate. Most cyber attacks begin with initial access via a compromised credential. This means that depending on the credential weaponized, the starting point for an attacker could be a few defense layers in, which completely changes the perspective of the attack and expands the field of visibility to the attacker. Node Zero users can account for this alternate perspective by using tests in the identity attack surface category with focus tests specifically on AWS Cloud and Azure hybrid environment. With the AWS pen test, Node Zero takes advantage of AWS's cloud formation as infrastructure as code to create a connection between Node Zero and an AWS account. This allows Node Zero to assume a role from within the AWS account with read-only permissions, to enumerate IAM permissions, publicly accessible EC2 instances, their open ports, and data resources like S3 buckets. By taking on a privileged external perspective, this removes any barriers to visibility, giving operators an honest lay of the land and an exceptional way to identify using identity-based attacks any systemic risks, weak controls, or exploitable instances that lead to privilege escalation, lateral movement, and overexposure of assets and credentials. The Azure Entra ID pen test primarily focused on undermining the entirety of the Azure identity ecosystem in a hybrid cloud environment. Entra ID, formerly known as Azure Active Directory, is used for two primary purposes. One, seamless synchronization of identities between on-prem and cloud Azure environments. Two, serving as the primary authentication and authorization service for various applications, especially Microsoft products like Azure, SharePoint, and O365. If an attacker can chain together exploits and techniques to escalate to Entra ID Global Admin, the entire enterprise tech stack utilizing Entra ID is considered vulnerable and no longer trustworthy. The Azure Entra ID pen tests test whether these types of attacks are possible in an organization by allowing users to inject an Entra ID credential from an internal perspective to test the Entra role-based access controls. Node Zero customers can then quickly validate their organization's cloud security posture and identity access management programs by exposing risks associated with credentials, 
identifying instances of excessive privilege across applications, and abusing misconfigurations in Entre Connect to exploit its way to the most privileged role possible, just like an adversary would. These tests then demonstrate ways in which an attacker can use weak identity controls to pivot from Azure to on-prem or vice versa, oftentimes doing so without using a single CVE. By taking a combined approach to cloud pen testing, between the infrastructure attack surface and identity attack surface categories, organizations are equipped with the necessary tools and methodologies to test from an attacker's perspective, trust but verify findings from tools like CNAPs and CSPMs, all with the flexibility and scalability to accommodate any security infrastructure.